Peggy 7. Hi there, I'm Glenn Egan from Sanzara Games, and I'm here with my good friend Frank to talk about another very cool feature of Sly Cooper Thieves in Time. So, Sly Cooper Thieves in Time comes out for both the PlayStation 3 and also the PlayStation Vita at the same time, and we wanted to come up with some nifty ways that you could create some interaction between the two devices. So, what we came up with is Augmented Reality Treasures. And this is a mode where you can essentially use your PlayStation Vita as a set of X-ray goggles to look into the game on the PlayStation 3 and look around for hidden collectibles. Now, Sly Cooper Thieves in Time is absolutely packed full of collectibles. I mean, we've got the costumes, we've got the clue bottles, we've got the Sly masks, we've got the treasure challenges, we've got all this stuff and it's all sort of spread around the world, kind of a little bit hard to find. But by using the Vita and the Augmented Reality Treasures mode, you can essentially peer into and see through the environment to find these. So here what I'm going to be able to do is just lift up the Vita and sync the image. And now if I tap on the Vita screen, you can see on the PlayStation 3 screen, it will highlight where that treasure is with my X-ray overlay. And you can see highlighted in orange, we got some treasures in the, uh, the large Japanese village hub environment here. So something else I noticed was that up, up to your right over here, yeah, just, yeah, the top of that, that pillar there, there's a, there's a piece of treasure. So I can head over there and grab those clue bottles. Yeah, it's, it's just at the top right up there. And there you can see how augmented reality's treasures works in Sly Cooper Thieves in Time.